Welcome back all you sports and gambling fans out there. Today we're doing some NHL betting coverage and joining me to help me out here is Ross Benjamin, our SBR contributor. The game we're looking at here is the Toronto Maple Leafs going up against the Edmonton Oilers. Ross, as always, a pleasure to have you here. How are you doing this fine morning? I'm doing very well and I would uh, encourage all the viewers to hold their nose when we talk about this contest because both of these teams absolutely stink. A couple of stinkers without a doubt. All right, let's start with uh, at least, I guess, the least worst of them all. Uh, how about <laughs> Toronto? Now, currently they're riding a two-game losing streak, and they're also 3-7 and seven in their last 10 games. But, you know, how much has this team been actually struggling, Ross? They've been struggling mightily, to say the least. The Leafs have also gone one and five in their last six. And during those six games, they've allowed a combined 27 goals. And that equates to a lofty 4.5 goals per contest. Not to mention the fact they've gone eight and 31 against the money line in their previous 39 overall. And also, Dax, how about this? A futile one and 12, excuse me, one and 20 against the money line in their previous 21 games on the road. Just absolutely horrific. Totally awful. I mean, well, at least when you thought that things couldn't get worse, they actually do. On the other side of the ice, we have the Edmonton Oilers, and they're coming into this match riding a seven-game losing streak and have only won one of their last ten games. Now, what else can you tell us about this awful team, Ross? The Oilers have seen each of their previous four contests go over the total and there was an average of 9.3 goals combined scored during those games. During that four-game stretch, Edmonton allowed an average of 5.8 goals per contest, and they've also scored exactly four goals in three of those four games. On a positive note, Edmonton has gone a sizzling 8 for 17 on the power play during their past five games. That's good for a 47.1% conversion rate, and that's excellent. The problem is they've also allowed opponents to go 6 for 17 on the power play against them during that exact time frame. So Edmonton uh, pretty equally is struggling like the Toronto Maple Leafs right now. And this is just a terrible matchup. <laughs> Without a doubt, man. And I mean, you, I, I bet you had a tough time picking out uh, which one of these two is to bet on. Uh, right now we have the line uh, that bookmaker set between minus 125 and minus 135 in favor of the Oilers. Now, the total was set at five and a half. What do we do here? I mean, which, which one of the worst teams do we take, Ross? Yeah, I mean, that's a good analogy. It's a good way to put it because this is one of those situations where you have to choose between the lesser of the two evils. Yep. The biggest determining factor for me, Dex, is that Toronto has been totally inept on the road, going 1-20 in their last 21 they're just a small underdog in this spot. Edmonton did open as a minus 115 favorite. They're up to, like you just alluded to, minus 125 to minus 135. Very rare where you'll see the Oilers as a favorite all see the rest of this season, I should say. I'm going to take Edmonton in this spot. Minus 125 over the hapless Leafs on the road. <laughs> All right, Ross, good stuff, man. Uh, tough pickings for this one, but hey, at least it's a pick, and uh, I guess we'll pick it up tomorrow again. I look forward to it, Dex. All right, man, take care. And everyone else, don't forget to check back with us tomorrow for some more sports coverage and your free picks. Till then, for SBR Picks, this is Dax Floyd.